Hey guys, welcome back to today's video. I'm gonna be doing a full and comprehensive review of the food delivery service Factor 75. I'll talk about the good and the bad, and then I'll tell you if I think Factor is worth trying or not. And as always, I'm gonna be giving you my honest opinion and as accurate a picture as possible of what Factor's meals are like so you can decide if you want to try it out yourself. All right, let's get into it. But before we do, if at any point you'd like to try Factor for yourself, I got a discount link down in the description that will get you a special deal that won't be available by going right to Factor's website. So feel free to check that out while it lasts. So Factor 75 is a food delivery service like Blue Apron or HelloFresh, but they deliver pre-prepared and cooked meals straight to your doorstep instead of just ingredients and recipe cards. But I think what makes Factor 75 stand out is that for the most part, it seems like most of their meals are based on low carb diets. They have a lot of meals that are keto, paleo, and gluten-free. They don't have meals exactly in these diets, but that does seem to be their main focus. Then within these categories, they have a variety of breakfast, lunch, and dinner meals, as well as side snacks and desserts. So let's talk about factors, plans, and pricings. You can get a shipment of 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, or 18 meals per week, and you can choose the meals yourself or let them do it for you. Now, I'm going to say that based on my research, the prices are a little bit above average. It's not crazy, but it's still a little bit higher than most other services, but Factor does prepare and cook the meals first, unlike most other services that just send you ingredients and recipe cards. So I do think the slightly higher cost is justified. Not to mention it saves me a bunch of time preparing and cooking the food. So if you buy the smallest box, which has six meals, it'll cost you around $13 a meal. The price goes down to around $11 per meal if you get 18 meals per week. Now let's talk about how the meals come. So everything is delivered fresh, which is different from a lot of other companies that deliver everything frozen. But it does have ice packs or freeze packs inside to keep everything cool during shipping. I have no problems of how the meals were delivered. But there were a few things that weren't so great about the way everything was packed and shipped. The first thing was that everything was in plastic containers. And I know that a lot of people don't like that, but in terms of ease of heating up, it really makes it easy because all the meals come in their own containers. And I'm not sure how you're able to heat it up nicely if the meals come in different type of containers, perhaps some type of cardboard, but I'm not an expert in that department. But if a lot of plastic packaging bothers you, keep that in mind. Next, we'll talk about how healthy the meals are, how many calories they have, and what you can expect. As I already said, most of their meals are geared towards the low carb diets. So many of their meals are marked as paleo, keto, or low carb. Even though they have other meals, this seems to be factors focus when it comes to healthy and nutrition. And one thing that I found really unique was that Factor offers a free 20 minute consultation with a nutritionist. And I've never seen a meal delivery service offer something like that. And I really stood out to me. But unfortunately, that wasn't something that I took advantage of myself because I knew what I was looking for, which is low carb meals. But I think it's cool to have the option. If you're even slightly curious, I'd say you should give it a try you got nothing to lose. Now, Factor does have a higher number of calories than many other services, which I really liked. I don't know why, maybe it's to save money or something, but it seems like a lot of other companies in this space are afraid to make meals with more than 500 calories, which usually doesn't fill me up. And a lot of the time you'll see meals that have only 200 or 300 calories and they're called meals. To me, 200 calories is basically a snack. And I think for like 90% of the people, even 300 calories is not even a meal. So I do like the factor has more generous calorie counts, which are usually between five to 800 calories. And I feel like I need a lot of these calories, especially since these are lower carb meals, which is my preference. Now the meals do tend to have a lot of fats, which is where a lot of their calories come from. But again, for me being low carb and even wanting to explore the keto diet, that wasn't a problem. I think the portions are fine, but you're not getting a huge amount of food or anything. Now, if you only eat plants or you are a vegetarian or a vegan, I wouldn't recommend this service to you. 
They don't have a great selection of these kinds of diets. I don't think there are enough plant-based or vegan options, and you probably won't be able to fill up a whole box without getting two of the same thing. So just keep that in mind. Also, you might not like these meals if you aren't looking for keto or lower carb meals and you prefer more carbs or starchy foods, so just keep that in mind as well. Now let's talk about the food itself. So I have to say honestly, I was really surprised by how good it tasted. In terms of taste, this is probably one of the best meal delivery services I've tried. I just feel like a lot of these services focus on really healthy, low calorie meals, which is actually really refreshing, but some lack flavor in my opinion, but Factors meals all have a lot of flavor and taste really good to me. So let's talk about what I actually tried. I decided to try the shrimp Alfredo, which had 560 calories, and I have to say it was delicious. I loved, loved, loved this meal. The shrimp, broccoli, and spaghetti squash in this dish all tasted very fresh and tasty and mixed really well together. It had a lot of flavor and was juicy. But you know, it wasn't like a huge amount of food because most of the volume of this dish came from lower calorie foods and a lot of the calories come from the butter, cheese, and sauce. And what you want to fill yourself up on in terms of sauces or more filling foods is kind of a personal preference but just keep it in mind. Some prefer their calories in the foods and don't mind having a bit less sauce and some prefer extra sauce and flavor and are willing to sacrifice on the main foods. So when I tried the risotto with vegetables, and to be honest, this one wasn't as memorable. Maybe a 6 or 7 out of a 10, but it was still pretty good. I tried the pumpkin pancakes, which looked the best out of all of the meals that I had. They were very sweet, and I'd say they even had more of a cake-like texture, which makes sense since these are lower carb pancakes. I probably would have liked regular pancakes better, but I'm really trying to stay low carb, so it's not Factor's fault. And then I tried the blackened salmon, and this one was delicious, and it had about 650 calories. I gave it a 9 out of 10, but I am a salmon lover, so if you don't love salmon like I do, you might want to look into another recipe. So I'd say that overall, I was very happy with how the food tasted. It was really fresh and had a lot of flavor. Now, what do I think about Factor 75 overall? Well, I think that Factor 75 would probably be perfect for certain people. Like if you're or want to try a low carb diet like keto or paleo, and you're trying to cut on your carbs like I am. So if lower carb meals is what you're interested in, then I think factor meals are a great choice and I would highly recommend them to you. But if you're not trying to cut on carbs, want more affordable meal delivery service, or prefer to cook the meals yourself, then I think there might be better places to go. And by the way, on my page I have videos reviewing Blue Apron, HelloFresh, Green Chef, and Home Chef as well to give you a better picture of the entire food delivery market. So feel free to check out my reviews on those services as well. But I do think that this is a great choice for a lot of people. I personally try to be lower carb and I don't really enjoy cooking so much, so Factor's the perfect choice for me. Again, if you're interested in Factor 75, I do have a discount link available in the description down below to help you save some extra money. So that's all. Definitely let me know in the comment section if you have any questions, comments, or things like that, and I'll do my best to try and answer them as fast as possible. And if you like this video, subscribe to my channel because I have a lot more videos coming your way. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.